croquet. It's recreational, it's competitive, and more often than not, it's known as a game for toffs. Until now, that is. Take a look at this critical game in action behind me. This is a Cheltenham Croquet Club, and they're trying to challenge that myth. We believe we have a wonderful sport here. It's suitable for all ages, both sexes, and we're looking for more people to join us because constantly when people do play, they say to us, why on earth didn't we know about this game before? And by the way, we are the best country in the world because we just thrash the Australians on their own turf. Every sport has its rules, so what are they in croquet? Right, here I am in front of the first hoop and I get my one shot. And I've gone through a hoop so I get one more shot. And I'm going to use that to hit yellow. That gives me two extra shots. First one with red against yellow is called the croquet shot. And so on. Well, you get the point anyway. The game of croquet is very enjoyable because you play on an equal footing with the men. All ages, you know, from 8 to 80 or even older, uh, both sexes. There's a handicap system for the association game. So, yes, you play on an equal footing and we're just as, as competitive as the, the men. It's, it's good. It's a unisex game and uh, the, the, the women play as just as good as the men. I think I've put myself in for a course, actually against uh, my will, but uh, no, I think it's an excellent game. I think uh, more young people should definitely be playing it as well. OK, Fiona, you've seen how easy it is. Perhaps mm -hmm. you'd like to have a go. Yeah, it look, looks easy enough, doesn't it? Go ahead. I guess, I guess if you want to become a champion at something or be in the England team, then this is probably the sport for me, I this guess. This is the one for you. I'll give it a go. Why not? Oh, it'd help if I could hit it, wouldn't it? Ah, oh, there we go. Just like that. Fiona Wilson and Cheltenham trying really hard for the Westernite.